What's up everyone? Welcome to the Durbin Compound. If we're meeting for the first time, my name is Devin Durbin. I'm here to bring you the tools, tips, and tricks to make you more self-sufficient. So today on the channel, we're talking about how to remount a dishwasher. Maybe you or a loved one has stepped on the door or otherwise mangled the brackets that are underneath the countertop and you need to refasten them. I'm going to show you just how to do it and maybe a trick you didn't know. So stay tuned. All right, guys, so at the top of your screen here, you can see where there are two mounting brackets that are underneath the countertop. So sometimes if you have a granite or stone countertop, there might be an anchor up here, but there are other mounting options that we'll go over here in a second. If you have a setup like this that has the two brackets above, this is what we're going to do. Uh, I have a Phillips screwdriver. We're going to take out each of these brackets. I'm gonna zoom in here so that you can see exactly what I'm doing. So as you loosen these screws down and out of the way here, they should be relatively short screws and you just plop them down out of here. So once you take them out, you can set them off to the side for now. Now, I always recommend when using, uh, when, when doing this on a countertop, you want to use just a screwdriver. Don't be using a drill or an impact. Um, to fear of stripping these out. So, you know, you only get a couple tries on this. So if your dishwasher is leaning forward when you open it like this, it's because you've messed up the brackets up here. Now, these are just cheap metal brackets and they're easily bendable. You can see how one is bent pretty badly. And sometimes they get mangled up and bent out of the way. So you want to make sure that they're bent just like this. So let's change a camera angle and I'm going to show you exactly how they fit into the top of the dishwasher. Okay, now that we have revealed the top of the dishwasher, you can see exactly how these fit into place. So if you can see the slot here, uh, there are two slots on the left and right. You want your bracket to kind of look like this. So once it goes in here, it's going to, it's going to fit in your slot like this and then the the tang of this bracket is going to stick out. Now you might have a shorter bracket if it is a shallower mounted dishwasher, but they should all be relatively the same. So what we're gonna do is slide it in and down so that it sits in the channel just like so. I hope that is illustrated well on camera. So once you have got this um, into place, you've probably mangled this or twisted this up because it is cheap pot metal. But uh, you know, once you've got it into place, you can slide the dishwasher back in and ensure that it is, is flush with the edge of your counter or your cabinets. Now, once you've got that back in, you can put your screws back up in the top here. I will do that now. All right, so once you've got that back into place, you can see that it is nice and rigid. So if you want an extra, um, you know, an extra precautionary thing or want some extra boost, there are some screws here in the side. Let's show you these. Okay, so I've already removed the little plastic cover here, but what this does is expose a little uh, joint in here where you can mount a screw. So this is going to mount directly into the side of your cabinet and will keep it from falling out on both sides, a little extra level of precaution. So if you're, if you're having some trouble with your brackets, you can simply just sink a screw into your cabinet here onto the left and right. Now with this, I recommend a fine threaded screw and you want a short screw so as to not go into your cabinet area. So we're not using three inch lag bolts here, just a small one inch fine threaded screw will get you going. All right, so if there was any question as to what the little plastic piece looks like, it looks just like this and then you can pop it out with your screwdriver. A little flathead screwdriver will get it to pop out and then you will just mount your screw right into the side of the cabinet here. 
and there's nothing excessive about that. You don't want to uh, really drive it in too hard. Now, I'm going to put a little extra on this because it wasn't all the way tight. All right. And it is done. And you can see how just, or just how tight that mounted it. Now, of course, you see how much uh, cabinet we have here. You wanna make sure your one inch screw does not go through. So after you're done, just pop your plastic piece on. You can go ahead and close your dishwasher. You have just mounted it into place and made it bulletproof. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. I hope that it helps someone out out there. Give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down, whatever you guys are into. If you haven't clicked subscribed already, click that subscribe button, and I guess we'll see you guys in the next video.